All right, we're gonna make a weaving today. And the first thing that you need to do is make your loom. So your loom is the base that you start with. And I'm gonna show you how to cut it. And when you're done cutting it, it's gonna look like this. It's gonna be connected on these two sides. And on the top and bottom, it's just gonna have these little slits in it. So how you do that is you fold it in half hamburger-wise, not hot dog. So you know that this is hot dog because it's long and skinny, right? That's hot dog. Hamburger is where it's wide and tall, kind of like a hamburger. So you're gonna fold it in half like a hamburger. And then I want you to draw maybe five or six lines, not more than that, five or six, that go from your fold. So you have this open side from the fold. And then I want you to stop about an inch away from the edge of the paper. So an inch is kind of like this part of your thumb. And then you want there to be an inch apart. So use this part of your thumb, inch apart, a straight line. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And now you're going to cut and you're gonna stop before you get to the end of the end of that. So here we go. When you're done cutting, you'll go ahead and open it up. And this is what your paper should look like. And I can use this side if I want to. Try to go ahead and flatten it out because you don't want to have it be popping up like that. So try and just flatten it out a little bit. There we go. Okay. Now, before I get going, I'm going to go ahead and write my name in the corner. So write your name. And now we'll get started with our weaving. So I have a whole bunch of strips here, and I actually made these strips from old artwork that people didn't want, or maybe they made a mistake, and I cut them into little strips. So there's all sorts of fun colors and different things. So you'll go ahead and just pick one out, doesn't matter, whatever color you like, and I'm gonna show you how you start your weaving. You're going to go ahead and, so you notice that we have one, two, three, four, five, six little openings that our paper can go through. And what you're gonna do is for your first opening, you're gonna go behind, and then you're gonna go over, and then you'll go behind, and then over, and then behind, and then over. Once you have that, you're gonna kinda just try and snug it off to the side as far as it'll go, and you'll take some glue, and you're gonna do just a dot, not a lot. If you put too much glue on, it's gonna make your entire weaving really difficult to work with. So all you need to do is put a, a little bit of glue at the top and bottom of your strip. And this strip is called a weft strip. The black part's called the warp, and this little strip is called the weft. So I'm gonna do just a dot, not a lot, and stick it down. Just a dot, not a lot, stick it down. So try and do your first piece. Go behind, over, behind, over, behind. So it's just like a pattern. And then glue it down. Good. Now let's do our next one. When we do our next one, we want to do the opposite of what we did the first time. So this first one goes over the black, right? So this time I want to go under the black. And then when I hit my first opening, I'm gonna go over the black, and I'm going to go under the black. Then over, then under, then over. There we go. Uh-oh, I made a mistake. Can you tell where I made a mistake? I made a mistake right there. And I know I made a mistake because at the end of my weaving, it should be a checkerboard where every other spot is black. But so it goes black, red, and then it should go black again. So here I need to make sure I go underneath. There we go. So now I have black, color, black, and then my next one's gonna be color. So I'm gonna take a moment and I'm gonna glue this one down. But you'll notice that I don't have little tabs on this one. I'm gonna go and flip it over real quick and I'm gonna glue it on the back. Just a dot, not a lot.
Good. Now we're going to do our third piece. I'm gonna pick up a, a bright color this time because that one was kind of dark. I'm gonna pick a bright one. And now we're gonna go opposite of what we did before. So before we went under, this time we're gonna go over. I'm gonna go over this piece, just like our first strip. Over and then under, over, under, over, under, over. There we go. And I'm gonna go ahead and do just a dot, not a lot, to glue it down. There we go, just a dot. Not a lot. Okay, see if you can get one, two, three weft pieces of paper through. I'm gonna keep going in fast motion. You can watch or you can keep working on yours. All right, it's done. Here is my weaving. It looks like a pattern. It has black color, black color, black color, black. All right, and then all the way across. Um, and you'll notice on the back that there's also a pattern there where it's all the, those kind of white pieces that are the back sides of these strips. I have my name on it. When you're done, you can put it in the drying rack. 